Yo, what's going on guys, your boy Fury here, and welcome back to Madden 19 Ultimate Team, guys. Today we're back with another gameplay on the Ultimate Team squad, and today we're actually starting to make the upgrades that I was talking about, like, two episodes ago. So, two episodes ago, not the one with the NFL draft pick video, but the one before that, I asked you guys about players that we should get on the team, and I said I was going to do polls for it, so I went on the Amino app, if you guys don't follow it, go check it out, download it, and then follow me on there so you can see my polls, but... I did the polls of every single position I said in that last video and say we're going to start going through those polls and actually putting those players in the lineup. So as you guys can see, looking at the lineup, the only thing that really changed is Patty Mahomes' card art, which is actually insane for Madden 20, which is really cool. But the new upgrade is not on offense today. I know I said I was going to move my one of my wide receiver spots and move one of my wide receivers to the bench and bring in a new wide receiver. But we did not do that today. So the new upgrade is on defense. So guys, for today's gameplay, we're actually replacing our right outside linebacker's position, which was Demario Davis. He's actually going to go middle linebacker, number two. But today for starting, one of the upgrades is 99 overall Lawrence Taylor. Now, when I did this poll, Lawrence Taylor pretty much won in a landslide compared to Anthony Barr. We still have him at the backup position, not even fully upgraded. So, I mean, I think he's just going to keep him there because I had all his cards in that. So, I decided just to power him up, probably keep him there for Ken Boost. But, so Lawrence Taylor actually won by a lot of votes. Honestly, I think it was like 30 to 1 or something like that. But, yeah, so this is going to be the card set. Let's take a look at his stats real quick. He's going to be compared to Demario Davis, I think, or Ryan Chazier. Yep, there you go. And literally looking at the stats right here, completely blows Demario Davis out of the water, beating him in literally every single category there is except for tackling. But then again, I feel like with Lawrence Taylor, he's got to help me play coverage a lot more because that's kind of defense I normally play. I mean, if anything, in today's gameplay, I'm going to be sending him to go get the quarterback because he has 98 block shed and 99 power move, which could definitely do some damage once he gets to those offensive linemen. He can literally just chuck him and then go right for the quarterback. So yeah guys, that's the new upgrade for today's video. Next upgrade is going to be our safety positions. So you guys, hopefully you guys will enjoy that when that video comes out too. But today is all going to be all about Lawrence Taylor trying to get to the quarterback. Lawrence Taylor picking off the football. Well here we go guys, this is my opponent's top three right here. Looking not that bad, Bruce Matthews in his top three. There's our top three. Don't know why DeMario Davis is still there. Lawrence Taylor is going to be on the sideline for right now as the offense takes the field first against our opponent. We're going to see what we can do right here. Patty Mahomes in his new card art. Okay. Yeah, Patty Mahomes in his new card art. So we're just going to see as... Oh, wow. I slid way too early. I definitely could have ran past him. Patty Mahomes' card art is probably one of the sickest cards in the game. I mean, with his like NFL Honors one, it didn't really look that good. But like now that we actually have him like in the Madden 20 background, it looks a lot better. we got Cooks right there off slants. And Dion's trying to strip it, but Cooks is just getting more yards. I just find it really like funny slash annoying how Demario Davis is still in my top three even though he's my backup I feel like if anything Lawrence Taylor should be I mean I know there's a lot of things that Madden needs to fix in our game but one major thing that I'm hoping comes to the ultimate team in like the next maybe year or two is the fact that you can customize who's your top three is okay there we go oh I actually got Kamar 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 as I'm ranting about Madden 20 and having a useless feature but I still want to see. Alec Kamara couldn't ke catch the ball at all. He literally hit him in the hands when I went for aggressive touch. But, okay, here we go. Oh, never mind. I got Todd Gurley right there. We just got to get the first. Todd Gurley is definitely going for more yards. All right, I got to score a little quicker just so I can actually get Lawrence Taylor on the field. Lawrence Taylor is definitely going to cause a rage quit today. Ho hopefully getting, like, a user fumble as I'm running right with Patty Mahomes. Oh, crap, as we're going to dive right there. I, I, I keep being able to get more yards by slide. I definitely could be getting more yards if I don't, like, dive early or dive prematurely with Patty Mahomes or slide prematurely with him. But, I mean, that that's my problem. I mean, if Patty Mahomes had better uh, carrying, he definitely would be fine. As I tried to throw it to Rob Gronkowski, he couldn't go for one. I kind of want to try and look for uh, Patty Mahomes' rushing touchdown, especially if it's not here. I mean, all of our back over series are in. Oh, he, he, has a, he has a QB spy. As I got him. I got Taysen Hill in the back of the end zone, tiptoe on the dot. Since we have Lawrence Taylor, I want him to try to go to the quarterback as much as possible. I think we're just going to run like kind of like this like mostly blitz kind of defense today. As, oh my god, my opponent, oh he's going, he's a triple option type of guy. Let's see if Lawrence Taylor plays in coverage right here. He, definitely, he has Russell Wilson, so I got to watch it, but okay. As, yep, I got it. Come here, there you go. Lawrence Taylor was first user sack. We definitely got to watch the Russell Wilson scramble. I got to get spy on whenever I can as, okay, come on. Yep, and there you go. That's... Fletcher Cox with a sack. Now we're going to completely drop back into coverage. I'm definitely going to try and get something with Lawrence Taylor. 
if this is a play I'm thinking, Tyree Kill should like go out on like a little wheel route, I think. Or I, I can just be completely wrong right here. As time's ticking down, let's just play some good coverage, Lawrence Taylor. At least we got one sack. Let's try to get an interception right now as okay, I was completely wrong. Uh, okay, I got it, got it. Oh no. Nope. Yep. See? Ah, oh, there we go. We got the pick with Lawrence Taylor. Let's go. We got the ball back. I kinda wanna decide what to do. Obviously this guy's a legit cupcake. I mean, but we're going to have to see if we can keep it in the game. I don't want to score way too... Oh, my God. It's, this is too easy at this point. Slants, dotting him up. Cooks, get, get him with that speed. Cook, come on. That's Deion Sanders. You should be able to outrun him. Now, guys, we got to determine what we're going to do right here in this situation. Now, I mean, I don't want to rage quit right away, but I got to do something as... Okay. Oh, yep. There we go. We got Calvin right there. Calvin's going to go all the way down to the one. I feel like Lawrence Taylor can definitely make more highlight plays. But the thing is, I don't know how long this guy's going to be in the game for that long. So, we're just going to score right here with Todd Gurley to the outside. Yep. And we'll see if he stays in the game a little longer. We're up by 14 now. I'm just going to try and send the dogs at him. Now, obviously, this guy's going to run triple option right here. As Yep. As Okay. We'll lock that up. I'll lock that up straight up. I'm going to get a pick with Lawrence Taylor right here. I'm going to get two. I'm hoping to get at least two picks today. Bait him a little bit with Lawrence Taylor. He's got the speed to be able to like, be running around the field. As Okay. Uh... uh Nope, that's a knockdown by Lattimore. I feel like only because Lawrence Taylor's stats are really bad in coverage, he's probably going to be my new user instead of Ryan Shazier, unless I get like a playing against a really bad person. But, oh, oh okay, okay. Oh, never mind. He doesn't want to do that. He actually doesn't want to do that. As, did, did he catch that? I don't know. With Madden on some BS sometimes, that definitely could have been a catch. That's why I actually question it. It, it kind of looked like it. But here we go. He's got third and ten. Again, we're I'm dropping back in the coverage. As, okay. Oh, nope. Oh man, he, oh wow, see I told you I have terrible user skills, but he's down to the 20, he's fighting, he's fighting. We're going to see Lawrence Taylor play coverage by himself right now, let's see, okay. As I'm coming up Dawkins, and I just pushed Russell Wilson for one yard. He already has third and 12 right now, he's, go, he's going for the hurry up after that last play. Let's see what he ends up doing as, oh, okay, come on, I'm literally going to pick it all, uh, oh, uh, uh, nope, oh wow, we actually knocked it down. So oddly, he ended up taking his three. I guess he, I guess he's in for the long run. I don't know. He taking taking his three points. See what you do. As literally, I'm running slants. I'm dying this man up right now with Calvin, and we're gonna get down the field probably almost before the one minute. All right, maybe the one minute mark is kind of an exaggeration because I'm just letting the clock clock run a little bit. But we're we're gonna get down the field pretty damn fast. As I'm, oh my god, until he actually he, he does not have an answer for this this little uh, slant pass right here. And we're back in field goal range. All right, no more running cheese plays. No more slants, at least for the rest of the half. We're going to go with the rest of the half. No more slant plays. We're just going to run our normal offense. Oh, my God. But those slants are amazing. i got Cooks right there. As Cooks is going to get some room. Uh, spin a little bit. Steps out of bounds, which is actually pretty good. I'm going to try and run it, too. Maybe catch him off guard because... Also, Taysom Hill's in, and I can't throw it to him off of that little drag route that I like. But, oh, yep. Oh, Todd, Todd, Todd Gurley's in the end zone. That's another touchdown, 21-3. to And there you go, guys. He finally paused it. Maybe he's going to quit. That was actually Bye. a great Have show a beautiful day. And, hell yeah, he's out of here. So I left you guys with only one game last episode, or last video, I should say, that I did. So I'm bringing you guys two now to make up for it. This guy has our good cards, but not actually chemmed up. Not at all scared of this guy's actual team right now i mean if anything we're just gonna have lawrence taylor place in coverage we got chazier on the spy as oh, oh what is that uh, oh that's a that's pa end around i think i haven't seen that play in a while pa end around is actually really annoying because like i feel like it just messes with my brain because of how badly that camera switches everything <laughs> it literally looks like it's an end around but then it's not but okay here's the run wow lock him up again defense defense is clamping up today i just want to see michael vick try and scramble and then the dogs go after him if we can get a mike vick fumble with lawrence taylor that'll be pretty cool as okay there we go there we go nope 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 as okay all right he dropped it at least i swear guy was there with lawrence taylor i'm actually a little mad right there we definitely could have made that play with lawrence taylor but here we go we're on offense he decided to punt us the football and oh okay okay uh I'm gonna cook. I'm gonna cook him. I'm cooking him with Michael Thomas, and that's a huge play all the way down to the 26. He tried mid blitzing too, which was the funny part. But we ended up like just sitting back with great protection. And okay, as there you go, we got Calvin over to the outside, and that is a touchdown. Let's go right away. Early score. I mean, it's not like these guys had really bad teams or really bad front three threes, I should say. But I mean, I'm just shocked. They're playing like crap right now. As 
Play action with Mike Vick. Oh, okay. As there, oh my god, that's the second one. I, I feel, I'm hoping they actually give me something to Lawrence Taylor. I'm able to get a pick six with him off of that. But, okay. As, no. Oh, I was so, wasn't there in time. I definitely could have jumped there out. We're holding rushing to single digit yards as of right now. He hasn't tried to scramble with Mike Vick yet, so that's actually pretty good. Keeping that spy up at the beginning of the game is keeping him under wraps as, okay, Lawrence Taylor's there to make a solid tackle on Ricky Williams. He's in five wide. Let's see what he does. Oh, okay. Never mind. I'm there. Oh, oh crap. Nope. I did. Well, oh, Marshall Lattimore got in my way. My opponent is definitely trying to establish the run game here. Let's see what he does on second and seven as, okay, play action this time. Oh, oh crap. Okay. All right. I got this. I got, I got this pass right here. As there you go. The Hounds finally get to him. Khalil Mack takes a huge loss. That was a 16-yard sack, and you got to think that this guy is going deep. So I'm just going to take Ryan Chaser. He's not scrambling as, okay. Uh, nope, nope, nope. As okay, I guess Mike Vick's Mike. Yeah, that's what you get, Mike Vick. Demario Davis hits your ass, and there you go. We made Mike Vick fumble. Unfortunately, it wasn't Lawrence Taylor, but we got the ball back. He paused the game, and we win six nothing. Well, guys, there you go. That's gonna be the gameplay for today. Just like the All Saints team video I put out the other day, I'm gonna take my wins when I can get them with this team and with Matt in general. Cause I mean, honestly, those guys had decent big threes, decent lineups. And I just feel like if I end up playing one more, I'm going to go against a complete sweat. And then I'm just going to be sitting here just sweating this the game out completely against this guy. So we're going to take it with Lawrence Taylor. He's got a pick. He's got a sack. He's got a bunch of solo tackles. I'm still a little pissed off how, like, he didn't get any interceptions that second game. Because he literally kept throwing to us. But it just bounced off our hands. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Safeties are going to come next episode. Our upgrades to those positions. So be on the lookout for that. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, subscribe, keep commenting more players you guys want me to forget for the All Saints team, for the Ultimate team, and any new ideas you guys want for videos. And I'll see you guys all next time. Peace out. Peace in the backfield as, okay, I'm going to get back Jason Hill as, Damn! oh my god, there you go, Cooks caught it off a tip, almost tipped interception. That was honestly.